This guy is a very rare case. And um, what do you mean a rare case? Like, as in what? A rare case of someone that's picked up a character that isn't DLC and just has started producing results immediately. Oh, oh he, okay. He's a, he's a very interesting case. He's only uh, been playing the game for like a year or so. And uh, I see. already, I think in the last few summer bars, he's just been producing amazing results. Yeah. Uh, despite this being loser's quarterfinals, I think this is literally second versus third seed. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Well, so I'm going to the third. I know. Uh, Uame is seated third. Takara should be seated second. Who was seated first? Uh, Kept. Kept. Who uh, we just saw win, I think, oh, in the I last game. He I just clutched out against J Dizzy. Oh, you're heading out. RFP right. Jonah. See you, dude. Goodbye. Uh, so, coming into this game, we have, like I said, two very big powerhouses of Simapa. Facing against each other, what is this? Top, you said top six. Yeah, it loses, loses quarters. quarters. Wow, that's crazy. And it's best of three. Mm -hmm. Wow. Uh, fairly even start. My Red Bull got in the way of looking at Uame's stocks. <laughs> And uh, Shots Red Bull. I saw Takara, I think uh, I was watching him over on the EGS stream. He actually beat Ice Climbers to get here. Ice Climbers. Which I think for Ken, uh, yeah, it was Fuwa. Fuwa. You, and oh, you <laughs> I think for Ken, it is not that easy uh, to fight against Ice Climbers. Oh, really? And, yeah. Why I, not? I feel, like, I feel like both of them are just like, if I touch you, you die type mm -hmm. characters. Yeah, that's fair. But I think it's a bigger case for, for like, I think, yeah, yeah, actually, now that you mentioned that, um, yeah, I mean, because cause Ice Climbers kind of gets most of their stuff off of, like, multi-hits and stuff, and yeah. the way that Ken would get out of that would be kind of focus attack. I, but I now, I believe, Takara faces even more of a difficult matchup in Uwame and his Olimar, who is already doing a very good job against him. Oh, yeah, no. Already a, like, this is basically a stock ahead at this point. Yeah, two yellows on a Uame at the moment. Two yellows and a blue. Let's Ooh. see how she decides Ooh, to get the nice kill. Unless Takara gets it first, a spike not being enough. Uh oh. Might be it. Oh. I thought a back air was going to come out there. For yeah, Takara, no, me too. But never mind. Apparently, it wouldn't have been true. Still in a good position though. And, and yeah, yep, get look the at those reactions. That yeah. was a single down tilt into Shoryuken. Seriously. That's uh, that's the type of uh, reaction kill confirm that you know most Ken mains can dream of. Yeah, and he just gets it back into the lead. Yeah. Max Rage as well, that definitely yeah. helped out. Uh, let's see how far he can extend this lead. Where am I getting an up air, but it's not going to be how enough. Did that up air almost hitting. All right, the Ashimo coming out from getting, Tagera. Getting, getting the damage in. Yep. This might be a kill here, actually. <laughs> I think if a back, I think a back air would have killed there. Yeah. Uh oh, oh but this is Max definitely Rage going to kill. Yet again, it. And, and wow. Takara ran away with that game after that game, uh, looking really. He cool. didn't even take. He took like 30% in that last like yeah. stock. It's just Takara just last two stocks. decided to stop dying at one point. <laughs> yeah. Look at where we are right now. Takara, the game ahead. Yeah. Yeah, I, th I really thought Uwem, uh, like Uwem was gonna like take that one. Um, but you know, honestly, it's Takara. I, I think we're kind of just used to seeing Takara come back. It's from survivability like at the end of the day. Like, I yeah, no, it's. I, I don't think Takara's Ken is himself without a comeback. <laughs> no, for sure. It's like an MK Leo, you know, like a. <laughs> yeah, MK Leo, but just game. In, in the game, sense. in the game yeah. itself, yeah. So let's see how Uame responds to this. We going have back. Hollow Bastion. Yeah, back now. Yeah, Bastion. going back. Takara with an aggressive tattoo, but doesn't work out for him. So yeah. Uame is kind of just fine. And Already has the pur platform. purple pigment out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's, he's not afraid to get aggressive. He is, yeah. U Uame, I believe, is a, I've seen his games quite a lot. He is an avid user of uh, the Myron zone. The Myron zone, He, he ah, yes. does like to kind of stack up on the purples. That's recovery. Uh, whenever he feels pressured. Yeah. So we'll uh, see how well that works out for him at the moment. Brilliant DI on that uh, F tilt. Yeah, but better recovery, oh my god. Just goes around Takara with the up -y. Honestly, like, you, you wouldn't think that that recovery would be like, hard to hit, but it's just, I don't know, like, I don't see anyone ever, like, hit it. It's... Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, nice use of the down B, uh to get out of what was potentially a very scary situation. It's been helping him get out of, like, a lot of combos in this matchup, but oh God. can't help him get out of that. Yeah, the strong quarter circle. Losing uh, two purple Pikmin too. Did you, <laughs> did you see who I made? Go for try the to grab, go for the, yeah, the try to do the cheese, yeah, the cheese You grab. cheesy man, you cheesy man. Oh my god. Takara saying it's going to take a little more for you to be able to take the stock off of him, but. We're still doing. Oh my god, that it's so good in this matchup, I guess. Yep. Just like getting out of those combos. 
Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. A parry parry up smash. Parrying is so good for Olimar, especially when you have purple. Yeah. Like, parry up smashes, parry up smashes, uh, especially against uh, characters like Ken who do not have that much range. It's just a guaranteed kill as, uh, as long as you have the right Pikmin, which is purple. Mm -hmm. uh, you can just... Or blue, out, you know. Smash, oh, smash. wow. Oh! That was, that was yeah, ballsy. A tense last stock uh, for Takera as yes, Huame once again finds himself ahead. Two oh wait, no, 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 no. Sorry, I thought. I thought no, no. Uh, Takera, Takera's, Takera's ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. my God. He's doing, br he's doing brilliant. Yeah, I was gonna right say, now. like, although Huame is down, Olimar definitely the character to be able to like rack up the damage, as you can see right here. Yeah, already. the moment he's, and I feel like Huame at any point can just start feeling like, okay, I'm not camping hard enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, and gets the stock there. Right, so he tries yeah, to go again, again, again for the he's, he's doing it again. <laughs> <laughs> I like it, I like it. He thinks Takara doesn't know. Does Looking he? for the ooh, Oh just, wow, just I'm just about really surprised. Just that misses the fair, yeah. yeah. Uh, that would have been big. Yeah, a little unfortunate with Wame's end. Oh, try trying to, to read force, it. yeah, trying to get a uh, kill here. Oh. Or a neutral tech. Oh, All right, focus brilliant tech. focus coming in from Takara, who could end the game with one solid bunch of hits and gets a nice grab. What am I really nice to get the stock here? All right. Oh, this might Only be it. Blue one. Oh, good DI coming in from Uwame. Every time I see Takara hit like a landing uh -oh. up air, I get really... <laughs> uh, yeah, Uwame uh, wasn't ready for that. Uh, yeah, I just, that was just not optimal <laughs> DI and Sheesh, Takara takes the game. Swift 2-0 coming yeah. in from Takara, I mean. Set. Like, this is, at this point, this is Mr. Sumaba. So... I know, for real. For him to be found and lose so well, who beat him? Was it Na Oh, it was Nata. Nata. It was it Nata. Nata. It was Nata. Yeah. My goat. I need to say hi to him. Yeah, and uh, I, I, I mean, making the losers run. Yeah, I, I was gonna, I was gonna introduce myself oh or yeah. say hi. Yeah. Um, but he <laughs> just lost. He he had oh. just lost his set. Oh. I don't know who it was too, but it was to an Isabel player. I'm sure, it wasn't capped. I don't think it was capped. When I looked at his tag, maybe it was. There are like no Isabels. It probably is capped then. Capped. I, that's yeah. what I thought it was, but I, I couldn't read the tag because I didn't have my glasses on. Mm. I'm gonna assume it is because again, yeah, who plays who plays Isabel? Yes. But yeah, I didn't want to say anything because it was last. <laughs> so, uh, Takara now, I believe we are going to see him for another game uh, coming up against Gorioka now, who is another prominent figure in Smapa. Another Smapa, Doesn't yeah. really, for some reason, when it comes to Smapas, Gorioka always does so well. Yeah. And takes so many good names. Whenever he's at a major, it just crumbles for him. Yeah, I don't yeah, yeah. understand why, because he is so, so good. Maybe it's the pressure. One of my favorite players. Uh, really? I think a lot of people, yeah. I think a lot of people outside of Japan do not know who this man is. Mm -hmm. For sure. He is one of Japan's best Joker players. I think we talk about it all the time yeah, on the stream. Like, it's, he's, like, no one knows who he is. So, like, every time he's on the stream, we always talk about and give a background about who he is. Yeah. I think, um, uh, not to make a Smashy Bros comparison.